<clears throat> yep, absolute maximum patience for me. Boss, he can't Anyone? come right now, but if we still need him in 20 minutes, he should be back. He's just grabbing his kid from school. Cool. Well, if he can get to Naxxon his own, I'll invite him. We'll always take an extra shaman. He probably won't get an SR though if he doesn't put it in before I lock the sheet. I'll lock the sheet when we get to Resupius. Or when we have our first trash drop. Whatever comes first. Test, 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 one, two. Oh crap, I missed one, that. Two, three, Thank four. you. I'm stopping. Just a general reminder, pay careful attention to the threat. You sometimes neglect it right as you're about to pull. It's usually done intentionally, don't worry. Although I might be sure mental. Usually intentionally. That's what I thought the problem was, to be honest. Let's get everybody buffed up. I'm still seeing quite a lot of people without spirit. And just to give everyone a heads up, you can turn this music bot down. One's about to turn the channel. I've gone to the habit because I like just being able to listen to something when it's quiet. Jockey music has joined. Don't know what it's going to play. Fools! You think yourselves triumphant? You have only taken one step closer to the abyss. When trash keeps coming, let's just go. Yeah, do the skull. Absolutely, take full control. Thanks, pretty much lead the raid. Remember, we're going to be going for death knights first. Wait the for the shit first, mm -hmm. right? Yeah. Have we got general blessing? Everyone stop pre-casting on Skull once it gets in your range. Remember, you can turn down the music bar if you don't want it. Spread the Necronites because of arcade explosions. Perfect. Go for Death Knights first and pull back. When we get to the Death Knight Captains, we want to make sure we are on top of the disarming. That is the only thing that will hurt us with that. Let's get ready to pull the next one. Perfect. And go for the Death Knight Captains. Focus Skull first. Make sure disarmed. Righty, let's pull the smiths on the right hand side. Do not continue. Turn back while there's still time. Pull it all the way back. Separate them because of thunderclap. Melee take care. The first kill goes to me. Anyone care to wait?
And we're going to pull this pack in the middle of the back. Start casting on Death Knight. Make sure we have a disarm on the captain, any warrior pick up. Get our captain down second. When the shade hits the middle, start recasting. Um, absolutely mate, sorry that's my bad. Did an item just drop? Yeah, we've had built the Grand Crusader. Raid is now locked. We picked up the captains, tanks react. Make sure both of them are disarmed, we need a second warrior over there please. them disarmed and start casting on the next skull once that's dead right straight onto cross gonna battle res lighting up now because it'll be about half an hour until we get to four horsemen Death Knight's first, Captain's second, make sure the Captains are disarmed. The patrol's just left, so we go for this pack straight away. Pull straight back into this room, don't go forward. Make sure we are getting curse of fucking life from these guys. We had one yeah, just for a Alright, pick up the Death Knight, get the captain disarmed, and we should be alright. Go for the next Death Knight. We have pulled a secondary pack. Tanks need to react. We have a Moonmark Death Knight, and there should be a another Death Knight captain. This Armex, if you can. Right. And we just have two Death Knights. Hey, we don't think. Someone here, we don't. Well, you should be good. The other guys don't hit that hard. Definitely slacking with disarms. Fools. You think yourselves triumphant? You have only taken one step closer to the abyss. Just run in. We may as well rest. Too many people died. Anyone can suggest songs by the way, just go to the bot channel type M exclamation point play and let's go. We will pull these death knights back. Let's get ready. Wait, stop, sorry. People are still getting rest. And Sarah Stomp has been rest, you go. Assuming key's not running. Alright, let's just go. So we are disarming the captains. You guys are doing well when there's just one of them. Mm. 
it shall be good, I captain to some. All the horses back to the stairs, killed one then the other. Make sure we hit the tank split. They do a fear that drops threat. All warriors press your fucking thunder button as the first action for any mob you encounter. Right, focus target skull. Once we kill skull we need to make sure the warriors are cursed up and then we casters can start going to kill the second one. Just keep going. Just just keep moving. Alright, Daxus, you're our only hunter today. You'll be taking on the responsibilities we normally give to Blaster Chan. So, this horse marked to a triangle, you'll be picking that one up. We'll be picking up Skull and Cross ourselves. You'll be pulling from over on this um, left hand, right hand side, and you'll be running your target up the stairs. You just need to kite it far enough away, you'll then start pushing Bane Death when we call for it. But the main thing is we want to drop our debuff before we have to deal with the other Death Knight Cavalier. So pull when it gets to the end of its reach. Whoever fucking shot, why? Daxus needs to pick up his target. Can people not fucking pull when we're coordinating shit? It'd be great. Alright, people drop your stacks, get the fuck away from it until you drop them all. <clears throat> I won't do the clip. Ah, uh, what now? Understood. Shadow Deed, one more ninja pull and I'm kicking you out of the raid. You were bench so you got lucky people didn't show up. You can turn the music off. Like right click jockey music, turn the volume to zero. Don't have the privilege. I can hear you. Hello, my fellow priest. Hello, it's me and you today. Yeah. I just had a leg spike. Thanks, check your mark. Put it up. Has the server crashed? No. No. Okay. My game's froze. We'll so if someone else can lead this, it's fine. Alright, well, we're, wait we're waiting for one more circulation anyway, so... Oh, we're back. Cool. Yeah, okay. Yeah, he'll go one more circle. Yeah. 
So what you won't be doing is standing over here if you are a caster where the screen mark is and you just peek in and hide when you see right. the devastating shout. I'm gonna pick up the guy now. And it dropped instantly. Interesting. Go, go reset. And we salvage or reset? Reset, reset. is cool, reset. let's go. Reset. It's on Copeland. On okay. Fidelia. Excellent stuff. God damn it, Cofield. This is what happens when we don't have Cofield, yeah. I miss my buddy. Alright. You had shadow resistance, eh? I dispelled my own. Where are we? Oh, I got rebuffed with Mark of the Wild. <laughs> Unavoidable. Yeah. Alright. Gonna go again. Do you wait for everyone to be rest? Uh, okay. Okay. He's rest. They're up. We could have made it, but it's too late now. God damn it, Cofield. Mithrin is a blade blade. Let it rip. Yeah. All right. Then be positioned. Disrupting shout in seven seconds. All right. I take the shout. Not an ideal spot, but it'll do. did not hide from the shout. Three seconds, ready, drop now. Pick up now, yeah. I'm All right. Cool, dropping mine. Shout four. Shouting two, hide. You can taunt now. Alright, taunting now. Take circle next. I'm ready. Oh. Alright, drop me get ready now, whatever. Got it. Alright, drop me mine. So you should take star, I think. Yeah. It's gonna be a little bit of a second, but we should be okay. Eight seconds. Uh, actually, this might be dubious. We might have to double Four. shield wall. My heels might have to push. Okay. Yeah, this is eight seconds. Okay, yeah, I'm ready to. Uh, I, I'm my like, controlling now, but you should be. Just tell me if you need it. You can talk. All right, I'll talk. Talk to now. You can right, start gonna, dropping yeah. your death knight. Drop I'm gonna it. Drop now. Perfect. Beautiful. And they all just kill themselves. That's what we'd love to see. Perfect. We only lost Ragnarok for it. Yes. Just as a reminder that all splinters are going to gust it all. Splinters to gust it all. Right. Fools! You think yourselves triumphant? You have only taken one step closer to the abyss. So we won't be pulling these back, spill the axe from the swords. Pull back into this doorway, don't extend into the room, your line of sighting your healers. Reminder that we are rolling for next patch rolls after off spec rules. Do not roll before that. Great reminder. We got two staffs to our right, that far. Yeah, that's okay. Pick up your totems, Zayamara. Never mind, they're good.
listed as bear, but, you know, no bears. Horses are incoming. I'll go straight on the shade. Horses are coming. Fine, I'll be a wimp. We could have pulled these all the way back already. They move pretty slowly for horses. Wait for it. We're waiting. We need to pull them back. Start Let's casting them on them now. Make sure we split up the Necro Knights, full focus on the Shade to begin with. Mm. Right, Diamond next, out of Dan Square. Don't really care otherwise. We'll check our assignments then. We have Mifrin on the undead horse, we have Copeland on the undead rider. Healbro lining up and Funky are on the living side, with Healbro on the center, lining up on the left, and Funky on the right. Healbro meaning the milkers. We only have two shackles this time, so the first rider with the first death knight, we'll make sure we shackle that one. We'll let one go, and then we'll shackle the one after. But as long as you guys just make sure we always have one shackled each, we should be okay. It does mean the undead side has to deal with an extra death knight sometimes with a rider. Just be aware of this, there is an extra target to tank. And Gorgarg, it's probably best that you still stay in some quite defensive gear just to help out with horses or riders. No Valorin. Next patch is alternative tier, we don't know what it's going to be. Cool. We have all the casts on this side, all physical DPS on the other side. Funky, you'll have to lead the undead. Wait, what side are you on, Funky? Mifrin, you're leading the undead side. First time you've uh, been on that side, and you will have to just figure it out. Sure. Don't do stupid shit. Yep. Ah, oh, yes, yes, yes. Uh -oh. And for Nate, Desire Mara, a roll on the undead side. Um, we're also going to send fire. Is Flegmo from the undead side too? Yep. Can we get cool. Might and Wokes, by the way? We can send fire as well, and oh, Moonchan's gone over as well, haven't they? Cool. Fire, go over. Flakeman's came back this side. Perfect. You guys already assembled yourselves on sides perfectly fine. We're going to begin the boss fight. You have sought your own demise. For reason, you have disregarded powers beyond your understanding. You have fought hard to invade the realm of the Harvester. Now, there is only one way out. To walk the lonely path of the dead.
Build the ride and make sure we interrupt it. Sorry, I was talking. We're going to start getting the next Death Knight to spawn Shackle. So on the right hand side, do not touch it. Donkey, what you can do is right click it and then hand hammer of justice it before it gets shackled, right? Yeah. Rider, make sure we interrupt to kill it dead. Trainee secondary. That's Death Knight's getting shackled too. Alright, we're going to be killing the Death Knight, so let's get this rider down first, make sure we get an intro out. Diamond loose. No, we have two priests, mate. Alright, we have a triple whammy coming up, so let's make sure we interrupt, make sure we get Death Knight and Trainees both picked up, get that Ride the Dead priority one. Rider is dead. Oh. Kill Death yeah. Knight's next. This one pick up the Elder Horse then. Living oh, needs I'll, to I'll slow do down. I'll do your god can also help pick up anything too. He's one of all of us signed, signed up tanks. Alright, how are you guys coping? Badly, or scary. Okay, because I didn't want to kill these shackled targets and people just started killing it while I was yeah. trying to figure out what's going on your side. It's okay now. We can kill Diamond, but he's also top one in the room, so let's just keep it shackled for now. You face the harvester of souls. That was a little sketchy. Alright, let's get our mana regen, get high any res and Ziomara. Then we have ghouls coming up. When the ghouls get to 50% health, you need to make sure they're getting stunned. Will they chain? Um, maybe. Let's go for the shade first. I do hope they stay alive long enough for me to introduce myself. Yep, chained. Cool. Get the shade first, either way. Perhaps they will come to their senses and run away as fast as they can. It's tanks or rogues, so I'm at the same level. Just because rogues got shafted for so long. Alright, and then time to get the ghouls now. I'll be honest, I'm just reading off the shade. Oh, uh, we're we still not looking up data. That's my bad. Too much admin work, man. We need stunts on the ghouls. Oh yeah, the tanks are dying. More people died to that trash then. Than the previous boss fight. Oh yeah, Mifring, you've been um, doing a runaway thing all raid. Okay, I'll reload then. We can pull these acolytes back, I'm just making sure we're safe to do so yet. 
stay all the way back so they don't start casting randomly in the middle. Lighten up, you picked up too close, mate. Incoming. Move back. And we're good to skip it all. That's the slime, it's not worth the risk. And let's pull these acolytes back. All the way back to where we currently are. And we run around. Next group of acolytes, we just literally body pull them around the corner. Let's get over the slime, start drinking again. I would like to see seven double pluses in chat from our tanks for four horsemen, please. That is seven indeed. Perfect. That means you know what you're doing. Let's pull these around the corner, guys. All right, and now I would like to see the 12 d double pluses from the healers, please. That's two, that's three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Eleven and twelve. Oh, if you are a DPS on this fight, or the tank starting off on pain, you'll be popping the shadow protection potion. We are checking. If you are a tank not starting off on Vayne, well, you are a healer. This is not a requirement for you guys. The only person who should be popping one still is Fanon. Mailbox here. And let's just make sure our tanks have fawn supplied to them because it oh, will just be a little bit. behind. Terra Stomper. Totem. Yep, pick up your totems, everybody. And that they don't have salvation, tanks <coughs> need salvation. Need fortitude on tanks, on warrior. I have fortitude on group 3 as well. Yeah, group 2 and 3. Thank you. Yeah. Make sure we get the full resources, just for because the, the first part of this fight's a burn where we're going to be popping our cooldowns once the first shield wall goes down. You do healer rotation or you do uh, healers follow the tanks? Um, Zaramara, right. Oh, yeah. shit, can you see next Monday now? Uh, yeah, yeah, I can. You're taking Jameis's assignments. So, um, you'll be sure. starting off on Lady, which is the one that is kept up in this north um, left-hand corner. And when you hear Mark 2, you'll be rotating around, clockwise around the room. Stacking. Okay. Lady is in south. Lady. Blamo is in the south. So to is the left, first. So? Yeah, yeah. I think I was saying it in reference to where we're currently stood. Yes. Cool. Uh, is everyone comfortable with what they need to do? Because like this is the most boring part. If you don't know what you're doing, speak up and we can explain it as detailed as needed. If 
we have the new shamans today here, so shaman also puts all your totem in this corner where we stay now, and mm. uh, just left them. Yeah, all totems deep in this corner, just so they will affect us as we're sneaking down there. Try to kill the, the first, uh, the first one directly red. Yeah, we try and nuke one down, and then we go. Okay. Um, everyone who is on DPS on this fight, after the fourth mark has been gone down, you need to be using your second shadow protection potion. You can potentially get out before you get hit by the fifth mark because we are killing it super fast. But that is all just down to RNG. So, I'm going to do a ready check. If it comes back positive, we're good to go. Who's been taken out of group one? Mummy can't just place the totem down in advance. Alright, whatever works for you mate. Cool, then we're ready to pull, no one's AFK. Mithrin, make sure you're pulling it back down on this right hand side. Yep. You seem to loop around every time. Yeah, yeah boss fire resist totem. All shamans fire resist totems, please. Ready to go? Yeah, we're good to go. Defend yes. Yourself. Please, Everybody hold late. DPS on playing for a second or two while Mithrin's just getting in position. So Alright. Yep, you're on the right track. Damage to begin. Pump Thane. I'll pull out the marks. Mark one. That was Mark 1. He was rotating. Your life is mine. Pop your cooldowns now. That was Mark 2. He was rotating. I like my meat extra crispy. Your life is mine. I... I have no choice Mark but That was Mark 3. Have you popped your cooldowns yet, people? I like my meat extra crispy. Your life is mine. I... I have no choice Mark but This is Mark me. 1 again. Also Mark 4. If you can get out, don't pop another Shadow Protection Potion, otherwise pop one. Your life is I, mine. I have no choice but to obey. Mark 5. Mark 2. Healers rotate. I'll go in next, Marks. Fuck you. I have no choice but to obey. Mark six. That's Mark three. Healers rotate. I, I have no choice but to obey. Mark Back seven. Mark one. I have no choice but to obey. Mark 8. That's Mark 2. Kanga, please battle res Bartek after you get out of here. I, I have no choice but to obey. Mark 9. That's Mark 3. I, yeah. I have no choice so but to obey. Mark 10. And we're coming in to take Mark Mogren. One. Should we go over I, I have no choice but to obey. Mark 11. That's Mark 2. Who's left? No choice but to Need obey. a tank on the Mark 12. That's Mark 3. Tank swap. I... I have no choice Your but to obey. Mark one. Back to Mark one. Give it to me, Mark one. I, I have no choice mine. but to obey. Mark two. That's Mark two. I, I have no choice but to obey. Your life is mine. Mark That's Mark 3. I I have no choice but to obey. Your life is mine. That's Who's Mark 1. Next? I have no choice but to obey. But you die. Can't missed. Your life is mine. 
Good guy, can you take? Mark five. That's Mark two. I Where the fuck did you I die, like no nut? Choice but to obey. Your life is mine. Coming in on Mark now. After Mark eighteen. Mark okay, six. that's Mark three. I, I have no choice but to obey. Your life is mine. Mark seven. We're Mark one again. I, I have no choice but to obey. Your life is mine. I, Mark I have doing. no choice but to obey. Healers keep rotating the foot, same rotation Your every time. Your life is mine. Only a glues. Yeah, coming to the Mark nine. I, I Mark have three. no choice but to obey. Red. Letting you pass it. Your life is mine. Uh, can Zinnia go with the next Mark tank? Three. To uh, the Mark left. Ten. Back to Mark one. I, I have no choice but to obey. Who is next tank on the left? Your life is mine. Just wait, mate. Mark 11. Mark 10. I have no choice but to obey. I can come, Lady B. Now. Lady B's dead. Alright, we're going to stop calling out rotation marks now. Just pay attention I to raid chat if you need to know where you are. If you are a DPS caster like Shadow Deed, stack with everybody else and don't just assume you know what you're doing. Stack, follow the caster stack, I, right? You want to all be together, no you don't want to all one. step in too far of a range. I need to try me and Chan's advice. It's, it's, Copeland. Copeland. it's following still, Copeland. 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 Copeland, turn around! Mark 2. I, I have no choice but to obey. Let's get that reposition deep in the corner, please, mummy. She has three marks already. Yeah, I, I can go in on next time. I have no choice mark but three. to obey. Everyone's I also going. have two, but uh, yeah, I can tag you a couple. Then you, you can go in with the next tank, please. Uh, I have too many marks now. I, I mark have no choice but to obey. Just let me who, know when. Who will be the next tank? Going in. Right, that's me. I'll be next then. I, Thank I you. Have no choice Mark to five. Obey. Keep him up. Need heals. Very low. You got no healers? I'm gonna die. I'm going on. Mark I, six. I have no choice but to obey. Uh, I can go with the tank after Strutter. Okay. I, which tank uh, is going to next? Brisket should be available in 10 seconds. Okay, okay. I'll go with you then. I'm on two marks now. This will be number three. Mark eight. Right, I'll go I in and no uh, mark nine. Alright, I'm heading out. Looks like... Uh, Gorgag has gone. Gor yeah, yeah Gorgag's going in. Mark nine. I have no choice but to obey. Very good. I Mark I 10. have no choice but to obey. Briscoe will go in uh, Mark 12. Okay. Mommy's going. Okay, mommy's going. Mark 11. I I have no choice but to obey. Is it near Mark check? Uh, three. I can take one more. Stay in, just nuke it, Dad. Mark 12. I, I have no choice but to obey. Rest. Yep, everyone make sure you rest people. If you want I loot from no the chest, wait obey. here to get your loot. If you are not here and you win the roll, it goes to the next highest person. We aren't here to fuck around with people needing to come back to loot stuff from the chest. Oh, Someone else I tag the loot in the chest? Can do. Away. There is a splinter in here, Gusta. Please make sure you take out your splinter. Don't want to be one short. Yeah, got it. What kind of idiot would do that? <laughs> <laughs> splinter of all three bosses. That's probably going to be it now for us to raid. <laughs> no, this is a 15 splinter day, mate. That's 10 now. Nice. That's going fast. Who dares violate the sanctity of my domain? Be warned. All who trespass um, here... I want to address something for Four Horsemen, please. When you die as a tank, 
it's very important to say where you've died because then we can assign someone to battle res you. Care for the patrol. Can't squeeze by yet. Remember, we left some trash up right so don't AFK brain off run. I've tried to mark the trash. Beautiful. Ah, uh, you said where before, not why. Mm hmm. I don't care about why you've died, I care about where you've died so I can get a battle res out. Like, that's why I was asking to make sure we could get you rest. Let's not pull anything while we're walking. I'm gonna be right back for a minute, so I'm gonna one, two, three. Please do some. Yep, loads of people start rolling too early. You should always wait until Loot Master actually calls for that spec ball because you only ask for hunters, then load of melee start rolling for some reason. Once we get here, make sure we jump down the ledge. If we're summoning people, let's summon them off of the ledge, please. That way everyone is in line of sight to be buffed. Just changing my spec real quick. If you are in the back, such as Zaromar, Augusta, Ayani, Hakuna, Matata, and Mishtem, just one, two, three. We have Warlocks. I got some GN, I'm helping. Perfect. Yeah, I went to get the room in the Four Horsemen room. That's all good. You didn't get the room on top, but it's fine. I only had two words anyway, and I already got one um, just after the CBS here. No, in Gothic's room, rather, yeah. Inside. Yeah, excellent. There's another rune on top of the ledge there for we'll jump down. Uh, yeah, maybe on the other team. Thanks, just pick up the warriors when needed. Whoever gets threat is perfect. We won't all be stacking pretty much together, that means all casters pretty much be directly on top of Noth. This way if you pull threat, it's very easy to be picked up. We don't want to have to chase around the room for it. If that means you'd have to take a hit or two, you take a hit or two. You dying is better than us having to chase it to pick it up. We aren't hitting you the teleport timer currently, but we don't want to be risk it either. What do you want to ask? So just new mark of the wild in group 3, it's running out. Oh, that's fine. If your buff's about to run out, just get rid of it. Might and warriors. Even if we do escape, is it possible to do some gargoyles? We're going to be doing this today, don't worry. Okay, cool. That's part of the plan. We do it after we um, kill this guy though, because we've already skipped him. Yeah, yeah, I mean, I, I mean, not button, don't want it to bothering anyone. Like, if you do, like, well, completely just go straight without doing it, it's fine. We're doing it this week on purpose. Shoot. Cool. Give us two seconds, I'm just looking at the people's health. You know what yeah, yeah, tanks, go. Oh, yeah. We're missing Flagma. Hopefully they accept the summon. Remember, D-Curse, this fight is priority one. Rise, my soldiers! Rise and fight once more! Good job, everybody. Go back to DPS. <clears throat> Remember, cleave off of Noth onto the warriors. Doesn't matter when they die as long as they're being tanked. Be a quick spell. 
Don Bryfus. Perfect. The curse or is that cripple? Rise, my soldiers. The cripple is magic. Rise and fight once more. Everyone remember stack on not, just so if you pull threat, you're good. Again, got them. Rise, my soldiers. Rise now, Deacons. Kill it, Dad. I will serve hold. the master. Dad. Yeah. The damage on those warriors was insane. Do you remember those bad and mappies adverts, Swaggy? Beautiful. Take the left gargoyle. Yep, we're going back up the stairs, everybody. Gargoyle time. Oh, I think it's a mountain like that. Yeah, yeah, we'll take the patrol first. Yep. Can we send a hunter pet at it, please? You can eyes at the beast, run after it, or you can just send it at it with attack. You mean skull or the other uh, gargoyles? Skull. It doesn't pull the sides. The pet is not a player and therefore does not activate them. Starting your oranges. I'll take the left one. Yep, yeah, cool. And we mark left with skull. Make sure we're leaving. Put max DPS on skull, get it dead. your oranges. For the quest. Well, let's go. Alternative tier, I guess, right? But that's why DPS would be rolling. Beware. Beware. Last pack. Um, was that all of them? Yeah, uh, five. Five, I think. This was five. Cool. Turn around. Who dares violate the sanctity of my domain? Be warned. All who trespass here are um, I think I missed context to whatever's been going on in raid chat. Repairable tear point. Alright, our Plague Beast is directly in front of us. If we can get that pulled, please, and then we can start killing this trash. We can pick up the beast. Yep. Send a Hunter Pet into it too, if needed. We want to kill this trash quickly, get that beast down. 
and start I got stunned. Someone else just pick it up. Need some on triangle? Stretch acid. And kill this trash, please, people. Focus skull before we do any AOE. This is so I can also get a benefit out of my hurricane. And everyone go around the corner, dodge the mushroom. I can the fat dwarf not fit for it. Fire plague water. beast marked with moon, pick up the plague beast marked with a moon, please. and get back your full resources we're going to pull very shortly we still have the bat step just literally spawned should end up with herbs next alright thanks we can pull remove totems Yep, replace your totems, kill the grubs if you're looking for something to do. Let Mithrin just position the boss and get it all ready. DPS, oh. focus the grubs. There's first eruption. That second eruption. That is great, my friend. Spot spike, we're going to be popping our greater shadow protection potion. We need to be pumping a little bit harder right now, but I assume once we hit exit phase, we will make up the extent of stick we have. Alright, time to nuke people. It's not fair, I've got Kenny for you. Beware. <laughs> 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 oh god. And crash. Yep, cool. Greater shadow protection potion. Right click it. Um fix the groups, what would we do? Mummy's still gonna be doing flame tongue. We take out Strutter because he's just going to be doing Annihilator and we put in coin. One hour or two. Yep, one hour consumes are coming up. I'm sorry guys, can anyone uh, auction out hold please, and smell box. Alright, I've saw one, I've saw two, I've saw three, and I've saw four. Who's number five in the healing order? I need to check the list. Yep, I need to go now look at the list. Princess is number five. Princess, I need to see your healing post. Need to see number five, then we go to number six. There's number five, let's see number six go. Yep, number seven. 
Number eight. <coughs> um, Meme Chan, can you change yours just to say back to number one, please? You are the end of our order today. Which position I'm taking over again? Jamis? You're taking over Jamis, but don't worry about it, you're not in the order. Yep. You have a free heal if shit goes wrong. Okay, cool. Alright, so, Spore Group's order today. Um, please don't whisper me while I'm trying to figure stuff out for a second. So, we're going to be starting with Group 6. We'll then be going over to Group 7. After that, we will then send the priests from Group 1, as well as two of our houses in there. Then we'll go for our Groups 2, 3, 4... 5 is just Shadow Deed, so... Then we have leftovers, then back to six. You could put Shadow Dead in group three. Yeah, Please fuck fight. it. That looks fine. When Emerald Blessing runs out, I'll re-put hit the button. Don't worry about it. Make sure everyone is buffed with their Shadow Protection Potion. I do have mine active, I don't know why it says I don't. Coin, Valor, and Mishtem are not able to get away with it. Mummy's is able to get away with it. Copeland, you need to pop it. Fanon, Meme Chan, and Princess. Meme Chan, have you got full tier 1? If so, you don't need to pop it. Just pop one as well. And he is in full tier 1. Cool, your whole group gets a benefit. That means Princess doesn't need to pop one either, but she has, which is fine. It's just extra benefit. Cool, we're going to be doing a pull time them for 10 seconds. Once it's gone, you need to get in the room. Salvan Warriors again, please. Got it. Emerald Blessing is running out. I have said in the past three minutes, yep. I will rebuff it once it runs out. Can people shut the fuck up and just be patient and listen? Cool, we're going to do a pull time of 10 seconds. Give mummy time for threat. That is the most important thing. Give her time for threat. If that means you're waiting for your spore, it means you're waiting for your spore. Spore groups have been posted. Five, I will repost four, it now just three, so it's obvious. Two, so in one. the room, don't be locked out. Or group one is group number six. It's either on the left or right side. I have a prediction it's going to be on the right, but it could be the left. So we're going to wait. It is on the right hand side. Group six, get your spawn. Group um, seven, you're next. Group seven, pop your spawn. Yep. Yeah. Group one, go get your spawn. Group 2, you are next for the sport. Time to go get it. Group 3, go get your sport. Group 4, go get your sport. Leftovers, go and get your spawn. Back to group six for the next spawn. Group six spawn. Perfect. Group seven, you're next. Four. Warlock group. I hope you got it. Group one, go get your spore. Pop this 
second shadow protection potion. If you need to. It's group two spore. Sorry. I'm getting distracted. Group three, you're next. Go. Shadow Deed, you're in group three. Group four, go get your spore. Leftovers, go get your spore. And we're good. Remember we have a two minute thing before we can pull more stuff. Um, low Feb's reflection, I don't know what the sheet says, I think it's probably just a useless item, but like any arcane resistant tanks are probably after that item for Kara 40. Yeah. So Kara 40 tank planners. Has my sound broke? Nope. No, it's good. Waiting for the debuff, then we're going to be going down the construct water, and then we'll do spider afterwards. Mummy, you did good, but you're tanking. You didn't die. That's what counts, right? Should we pull the retro? Yeah, we can pull it. Sorry, I'm distracted by a lot of shit right now. Alright, cool. Thanks for out your marks for these patchwork golems. Make sure you pull them. Flap on pull. Let's go. Pull time at 8 seconds. 5, 4, Need 3, There's all marks. 2, Thanks, go. 1. Make sure you are flapping on pull as a melee deep. Yes, it just helps. I think Moon and Cross changed. You don't have any assigns on Construct. Can I get this back? Do we have spiders? We're, We're not getting spiders. spiders, I said that. Oh, Please, okay. people, start listening to me, otherwise you can start leading the raid instead. So we're all going to be waiting further back in this room. This is so we don't have to worry about having faps for the pull. When the war sum happens, we just then pick up and pull out the targets. I, we just need consistent tanks on each target we have pulled. <clears throat> Wait for the war sum. Wait for threat again. 
it's on the melee, and we get it. Thunders. Pull the next pack back. Yeah. Everyone back to where we were stacking initially. There's first wall stump. We're good, we can kill this cross and square as well. I'll pull the belcher. Yes. I'll be back briefly after this, let's go put stuff in some drawer. Alright. Triple. Yeah, all them split them up. Make sure you flap on pull. Triangle next. Controllers are coming around the room. We have pulled the slimes, someone got too close. It was on a healer, but can't tell for certain who. Get your AoE out, everybody. Make sure you don't stand in the line of the fucking slimes, otherwise you will probably die. That is some big damage going out, love to see it. Beautiful job, and he's in perfect position to pull. Alright, we can pull Skull now while it's in its current position. Stay on this side of the slime for a second. Nope, we're just gonna jump over, mate. Eat your oranges. We want to be pre-casting a living monstrosity. When they summon a lightning totem, we need to make sure everyone is hitting it. All the melee specifically, I should say. If you don't kill the totem, why not? It is the thing that's going to do the biggest amount of damage. It's the worst thing about this fight with these guys. So kill the yeah. totem as soon as you can. Last week, two melee did 40% of the damage to them, so... Let's all do it! We're going to pre-cast now. It's going to be a 10 second timer. Hit it for zero. Five. Seven, four. four three. three. Two, one. one. Hit the cunt. Kill it dead. And I think we avoided the totem. Good job, people. More of that. Next skull mark is out. We do another pull timer for 10 seconds. We hit it for zero. Five, 
four, three, three two, two, one, one, zero. Hit the guy. Good job. Anger is down. Alright, tanks need to use FAP on this pool. Make sure you spread out the targets. You do have different assignments for these backs, as you probably noticed as we've been going down the roster. But that's completely okay. If you're ready, tanks run in and pull. Marcy will just start going forward. Pick up, make a line of them, start with skull first. Melee, I'd have recommend you FAP on pull too. Get ready to pre-cast, full time 10 seconds is go. Hit it for Five, zero in four, four three, two, two one, one, zero. Make sure you kill the mad scientist. Throw out an AOE taunt, pop the person who taunts. going to summon Gusto next. This also gives people time to get their mana back, so let's summon Gusto. Click the summoning portal, people. Can we get a pull time of descent? Five, hit it for zero. Four, three, three, two, two, one, one, and zero. Can someone be a Chad and give Rifus a lip or two? He will happily pay for it. Correct. Healers give me a plus. Wait to pull the next pack. We won't miss them to change specs. Only give me a plus if you know what your assignment is, by the way. Otherwise, what's the point? Daramara, you're taking Jameis' assignment. You will be on Mummy Milkies. Okay. She's the shaman tank. I don't remember what specifically we gave her to do. She will be soaking. Let's get pulling this next pack then. Send out the pull timer because Mifrin Mishtem has changed spec. Come on, make sure you guys preserve your rage after this pack. Just so we can go into the next thing with a little bit more rage ready. I need food buffs before the fight. Oh, balls, okay. And Kanga died again. I didn't even Sansa. I mean don't, don't tell anyone. Cool. Tanks. Stack together. Stack together where you know you're going to be pulling from. 
Lining up, you are the main tank today, Imp, so you have to be pumping your threat as hard as you can. You aren't here to soak the hatefuls, but you will still be getting hit by a few. You know what you need to do, you start off here and then you come off to the side pretty much here. So you're at 90 degrees to the rest of the tanks. Once the all tanks stacking together, I didn't count how many pluses I had, so can you give me a plus if you know your healing assignment for patchwork? So that's 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, one more. Who are we missing? I think James. There we are. Moon Chan. We're done. Cool. Healers know what they're doing, tanks know what they're doing, we can get ready to pull. There are some rats behind us if warriors with tanks want to use them for rage real quick. Otherwise we can just wait for you guys to build up threat either way. Pull is live the second the tanks want to start shooting at it. Pull timer for six seconds so you can Five, aim for zero to hit four, it. Four, three, two, one. Make right. And war. make sure you give the tanks time for threat. No one else is to do damage until you get told to do damage. DPS, get the fuck away from the boss. Okay, yeah, mommy's dead. Yep, yeah, cool. It's gonna be a two tank fight. You can get, start doing damage. Whoever gets third on threat, good luck to you. Hopefully, you don't have too much health. So mommy healers, Goat, Audrey, Mitran and Gorgark. That's Poam, Zayamara and Nate. Spread out. Yeah. Um, you're taking I should, it's gonna fuck over him, but like, yeah. I won't go on flame tongue, please. Remove Tranquil Air as well then. Remember to refresh stone shield. Mm -hmm. Oh, poor my. You steal my Marlot and get one shot. What is this? Obviously it's Cofield's fault, alright? But like, someone else is partially to blame. There we go! You found the guy. We blame Zam as well. Alright, get ready for Enrage, big heals. Seeing 4k crits. We're getting splinters in every pack. Not in the boss. So, Same. yeah. We didn't get even the first two in Plague, but yeah. We've got like five today already, right? Yeah, five out, of, five out of seven so far has been going. <laughs> <laughs> that is good RNG. No, there'll be good weeks and bad weeks, you know. That's what it is, so.
Wait, why is the area logged off? Remember, drink up once you get over the slime. They are missed and might ninja them, you never know. Do you trust this guy? Wait, what am I stealing? Um, polarity. Oh, definitely. Should we go? Yeah, we can pull. Make sure we're interrupting these guys at all times, please. Get that slime bolt interrupted. Stun them as well. We got hit by one slime bolt. We failed their interrupt. There is so many melee DPS with interrupts. Interrupt the slime bolt. I don't need to remind you, you see a cast bar, you interrupt. We're pulling back. Why do I keep bringing new people who are competition on the circuits? I need a prospect. Or even alternative tier specs, but that's even worse. Interrupt the slime bots. Right. I'm pulling. Slime bolts you can, and we can stack them together for maximum cleavage. Did you say cleavage? Maximum cleavage. Interrupt. You guys want more cleavage like that? You interrupt as well as you're doing, and we can get it. They say only fans we go for maximum cleavage. <laughs> that's good. <laughs> your resources. I don't remember who I assigned to tank this, but whoever is, good luck. Have fun. Sure. You can pull it, just make sure that we are behind the boss's back at all times. You can wait for him to start going up the stairs if you want. I make yeah, wait a bit. People need some banner. They really don't. Eh. They didn't. <clears throat> uh, I go. Alright, turn it around. Everyone behind the guy. You will be charged. How much damage you can And 90 degrees turn? Sorry, guys. No, I'm not just waiting. When you get a deeper fungi, you, you'll have a skull above your head. Run to the leftmost wall from behind the boss's ass. Get the slime, make sure you're focusing it if you are a melee DPS. The boss is turning. Am I moving it too quickly? No, it's fine. Go whatever place you want, mate. Go on, to the wall! You only need to move him and then pause and close out. Yeah, all that slime. Mm. 
and never move him during a slime spray when, if you're taking a corner. That's when yeah. you're most likely to get right the fuck up. I'll turn him after the slime spray here. Yep, everyone don't be in front of the boss. Slime spray is coming soon to a raid near you and move. Your link is shadow deed. Shadow deed to the leftmost wall. Why are you running towards the fucking boss? Can we kill it before the next cloud? Yes. Oh, I just ran to cloud shadow deed left in the middle of the fucking room, of course. Okay, I need to respect. Uh, so costly. Do it. Oh, it does? Yeah. Yeah. That sh sounds good. Oh, beautiful. Oh, right. Perfect. Do you run piercing cow by default or do you need to respect, mate? Oh, sorry, I just looted the rooms from there. That's a couple. He has it base. Cool. That's kind of chad mate that you have it as a base. Miss them, do you want anyone who wants it for the next patch to just roll base 100 so you can see more yep, clearly? I yeah, do not give me a 50, a 99, anything like that. If you roll for the thing I'm asking you for, otherwise do not roll. Yeah, roll 1 to 50, you have a token. Interesting. <laughs> Alrighty, we can go down this pipe. Do not heal during the pipe unless you are a tank. Let's go. Oops. Don't look at the threat meter. Nobody look at the threat meter. Did you heal yourself? Oh. That's fine. It's on Ragnarok, it's on Mummy Milkies. Remember, give them a second full threat before you break it. Does you do it? Get the boss moving. Parastomp is ripped for threat. No, I died. No. You thought we haven't got good heals? Or. What's the heal? I don't know. Speed froze, then I'm dead. Take care with threat, Mummy Milkies is currently tanking. Pastors take very big care. Like Magician and Aria, you are ripping threat. Please don't run away. Res on Mithrin. Don't run it to the zombies, that's probably rule one. We need He's a tank, tank in the chat. Take all the tanks are dead. Can someone battle Res Mithrin? Anybody? That took too long. Risk is trying to pick him up. Uh, 
best mate incoming. The big heels are about to go through. Don't I won't. Can we not pump threat until we have this stabilized from anybody? Kill the zombies, they're coming to him. I got the bus. Kill the zombies now, everybody. Every fucking person attack the zombies. Use a T, it's on Mithra in the game, perfect. Does Meme-chan need an innovate? Meme-chan's dead. We need someone to start spamming kings. And the we got? Save the fair word. They're all... Keep on warriors most likely, but like... Okay, can I don't know if this is a white item? one. I need German totem rebuilt. I don't get any stacks. Yeah, he's got eight stacks so far. Copeland, can you pump Brad? Get rid of yourself. Threats. Uh, stacks dropped. Funny. Okay. We're gonna have one more test, mate. Yeah. Get ready to kill the zombies again, everybody. Second decimate goes out, we're gonna have a health drop on every single person. We're gonna require a bit of healing. Fair word again. Decimate Beware. out. Kill the zombies, they're running towards the boss. More and more people are dying. Who's doing king spam so I know who to invent? Understood. Yeah, I'm dead. Alright, just fucking wipe it, people. Paladins, type in chat, you aren't using voice, but I'm asking for someone to do king spam and no one's actually fucking replying to me here. Like, part of this tactic is that we have someone spamming kings to pull maximum threat to keep the zombies away from the guy, because they help him heal. But that's not happening, so the zombies are wiping half the fucking raid, nuking our damage as we're trying to keep going forward. Like, so communicate, I'm literally asking it in voice for people to do a job and getting no replies. That's fair poem, right? Like, I did see that, and just anyone, mostly warriors, would be your target for, for it. But Meme Chan died, which is fine, that can happen. We need to make sure that we have backup in place, though. Anyone who can at least go, what else am I doing? I think you died at a certain point, too, so... We're all running, right? Yeah, just calm. Where's the number? Yeah, yeah, we're all running. Yep. Rez there. These people are stupid. What do we actually yeah. have the most of in this raid? I think it might actually be paladins. It is. You'll be king spamming on paladins. Yeah, guys, when you know that a tank's died as well, there's going to be a period where the other tanks have to pick up and the boss might be moving so they're not getting threats. So if you see any, like, if you see a tank or two die, like, that should be an indicator for all the DPS to stop for a few seconds to let my threat get re established. Because I'm no. just going to get people over the place. Current fight deaths. Mithrin had two. Why did Mithrin die the first time? I think they said that healers were third. That's, she probably stopped on the timer. You took 5k damage at once. And 
full health, got hit for 1.7k, got healed for about 5k, took 5k damage, died? I don't understand. I wasn't able to fear ward any healers since I was stuck at the previous boss's corpse. Yeah. Which might have contributed. The fear wouldn't kill him though, the fear would stop him taking damage. The slimes are back, okay. I don't think it was parry haste, but could have been. Let's make sure we're all buffed up. Alrighty, let's pull these slimes, get them dead. Remember, don't stand in the line of the path because you'll just fucking get wiped out. Funky, you're a lucky motherfucker and you know it. So I take a few risks Alright, Rez lightning up. Don't rebuff him. RAP. Sorry, that was stupid. everybody group up again together so let's explain this boss fight for the people who are not 
We use a tactic where we have a warrior running around with piercing howl, two slow to zombie chows that are getting kited by a paladin who is spamming blessing of kings on the class that we have the most of. Usually this is warriors because hunter pets are also classed as warriors. Right now we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven warriors and one hunter pet, so eight of those classes in that raid. Or alternatively have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight paladins. So we can have a king spam on paladins or warriors to do the same amount of threat generation. And whoever is doing the kiting will need to make sure they're hitting to generate rage so they can spam their piercing howl. Yes. 100%. Our main tank for this boss fight is going to be... I need to go check the assignment. But it is all literally written out in plain text. Mummy will be main tank when we get. We have Gorgog doing piercing howl and Mithrin chasing threat. We will be fear warding Mummy to begin with, but afterwards when we need to swap the tank we'll be fear warding Mithrin. So it should be all good. Just let them position it, let them build threat. Don't do damage until the boss is at the wall and you hear someone go, It's time to do damage! But we can begin the kiting and the piercing house spamming before then. Does everyone understand this boss fight? I'm going to give you guys a ready check. If you don't understand, say something. This is a slow ready check if you all understand. Alrighty. Do not heal down the tunnel. Give the tanks time to build threat. Let us commence. Make sure a tank jumps off first. It's in position. The Mithrin who's building threat. I see Zinnia on the threat table. Come on, buddy. All play together. Alright, we can begin DPS. I missed that. That's okay. Copeland. A funky second. Beautiful, mate. Your trank shot and go cool down. Shadow Deed is now second on threat. Keep me from fear warded. What we're going to need to be pumping now as hard as we can. We have 40 seconds to kill it. Hopefully, he doesn't build too many stacks in this time. Big heals on. Ready to look through this time? Yeah, forward. No forward, no forward. Do you have point two of me there? Okay, It's salvageable, don't worry. No, but I use Berserker Rage. And kill it, Dad. This is how I remember this book? Yeah, yeah, this is normally just a kill it, Dad boss. I've never wiped this once in my life. <clears throat> Was a lack of two trank shots? No, I don't think so. Okay. How is it always Death Sparky? We literally didn't have it for weeks and weeks until this week. I think Zion is going to be happy. Like, I'd like to drop two, two times in a row. This always drop. Oh, yes, I did. Chad. <laughs> That's a shockingly disappointing <laughs> pair of rolls, I'd like to say. <laughs> <laughs> okay, if you have a mana bar, you are on the left hand side. Pay attention to the tank assignment. If you are a shaman in the melee group, you are on the um, right hand side so that you're with those guys. We body pull, so we're going to be doing a pull timer for this boss fight. If you're on the right hand side, you're popping a nature protection potion now, please.
as far as how was the split again? So you're a um, shaman, right? Yep. Go to your melee group. On the right hand side. Okay. We have seven healers on the left. How many do we have on the right? Three at the moment. Oh, okay, cool. Um, we'll be sending Drulinka over to the right hand side as well as Coincidence. Cool. We're going to be body pulling. I'm going to do a 10 second pull timer. I hope our tanks know what Five, side they're meant to be on and what they're four, doing. Three, two, one. Let's go. Walk straight in. No one attack until it's positioned. Alright, casters, we're DPSing very hard, but you need to stop DPS at around 15%. Please. And that means stop all damage. Swap is now. Casters, stop casting. No more cast. Stop your casting. Stop the fucking casting, people. Alrighty, wait, start casting now, kill it dead, melee kill yours dead, make sure you jump off the edge. Back up, negative are going left, positive are going right, negative are going left, positive are going right. Pay attention to your debuffs, you're about to get it. Negative, Negative left, negative. positive right. Stack up nice and tight. Start looking at your debuff. Wait and see if it changes. If your debuff changes, run straight through the boss to the other stack. Zaymara, are you on the wrong side, buddy? Yeah, I know I have minus. I don't want to kill everyone of us. Just on next clarity shift, you can run. Yep. Pay attention to your debuffs, people. They're about to change. He's casting it now. Swap sides if you need to swap sides. Run through the boss. <laughs> you need to bag him before we start the boss fight. Pay attention to your debuff. Positive swap sides if you need to swap sides. The second he dies, take the teleporter if you have a positive debuff and you don't need any of the loot. The loot, just for reference, is all of... Never mind, someone just ran in and exploded us. Good job, you fucking idiot. Yes, master. Down. It's Castigator and two tokens. Yeah, I saw Castigator. And a Splinter, I think.
debuff. You can't res while you still have a debuff because you do damage to people who don't have the same debuff as you. Don't make me change my stance on we bring everybody we can and we fill up to 40. Maybe I will just suddenly start going, okay, we can bench down to 35. If whatever makes the raid go smoother, I'm not here for an idiot show. Yes, take it off. I can do the first day we don't. I need to relog real quick. Should pull them? Yeah, absolutely. If you can get the scares, get the scares. No, I can't. Only have one pack. Alloy don't. For this, it is very vital that we get down the Venom Stalker first. You need to be using your Elixir of Poison Resistance to clear your own poison. Now we have a lot of Shamans in this raid, which makes it all a bit easier for us, everyone here. But you're still personally responsible for your own poison debuff. Just because you have a Shaman doesn't mean you can't use your potion. Tanks, pick up your marks, they are all assigned for you. Five, four, three, two. Whoever one. is on both marks, you're picking up the Dread Creepers. Get this Venom Stalker dead. Beautiful job, and we can just kill the rest of it. Well, exact same as the previous pack, get a pull timer going. Oh, I went in. Venom Stalker is loose currently. Good job, Bartek. Nice tanking. See him thrilling out. Mm -hmm. cool. Let's make sure we get people back to full mana. Good. Tanks get ready to pull. Cleave on from the boss onto the adds. 
So pull the adds to the boss's ass, and we just uh, attack the boss and cleave the adds down. Here we go. Yeah, we can pull. Remember, pull the adds to the boss's ass, tilt it a little bit just so the casters are on the stack and right behind it. Get these corpse scarabs dead because like Sharky just died. Second crit guard. Scarves, make sure we pick them up, kill them dead. <laughs> Should I move him? Um, yeah, let's move him to the into the regular position before we have to start kiting. Pump your fucking damage, people. Second, you see that ass go in the air, you need to start running away. Get away from that man! And killed it dead. Good job. I'm sick of seeing the warrior tokens. Yes. If we can open this gate, we can have a pardon and just consecrate. We don't really care about AoE taunt, we just care about picking them all up. Where is the next pack anyway? It's coming round, wait for it to come round, wait for the orange circle. If someone just stands in the doorway. Are we getting that pack behind us as well? Like the, yes, the, double the pack. Quest, for the quest. Oh, maybe. They normally get enough of the spiders though, it's the um, gargoyles that you don't ever kill. Beautiful job, people. I think it is that Venom is talking to me. That's all. Whoever's on the quest, what's your progress with the quest? Like, what do you still need? Uh, one Venom's talk. Fine, we'll kill it. Right, you Marcus, thanks. Let's go. Maximum damage. Dispel poison. Just want to keep in mind, folks, about the um, little blessing. It's not a free buff. Like it does cost a bright dream shard each time, and then like two copies. Mm -hmm. Cool. Thanks, you're all standing on this green mark here, behind the side of the door. All other DPS and healers, you're on this purple mark on the other side. Wait, Daxus, you'll be pulling. You'll be standing where I am currently. You'll be taking a shot and shooting for the star target. You'll be kiting star target all the way back into a Nubrakhan's room. And once you have took it into a Nubrakhan's room, you'll then be feigning death because we'll have killed one of your targets in that time. So we pick up all the mobs, get some of them dead, at least one or two of them. Then we can pick up trying and um, star again. Yeah, freak. Yep, you can drop it. Just feign death, Daxus. 
Beautiful. And we picked it up. Poke the wall. Touch it like it's your lover. It's the concrete. We have two Venom Stalkers coming up next as well as Skitterers. Just be aware we're going to need to consecrate down. And we need to make sure we're on top of the poison cleansing. We're pulling it all pretty much together now. Incoming. We're pulling it round, not in, but okay, whatever you guys want. Dispel poison. More skitterers incoming. the venom stalkers we might end up picking these infectious skitterers too but that's okay we nuke skull Dispel first and poison. always please double place your shaman totems if you have double poison stacks in your group it just helps out dispel poison well res the loot master we aren't doing anything about it old lives your mortal desires mean nothing you are acolytes of the Master now, and you will serve the cause without question. The greatest glory is to die in the Master's service. We have Skitterers coming. Funky, can you pick these up? Beautiful. Kill them dead. Maybe I'm down. Alrighty. I'm going to start precasting on Skull. Make sure you hit after me. We'll wait for them to start casting. Run the fuck out of the way. Skull is dead. Kill him dead. Do not attack the cultist unless the acolytes are dead. If you're waiting on the pull to do something, that's fine. In fact, it's favourable. Because then you want griefing us while we're trying to pull anything. I know it's a boring process, but you've got to follow it. Casting. They're casting Ivron. We only need one tank on the cultists on pull, by the way. I don't know why there's like four people all dead. Yeah, but Just let Mifrin do his job. You were slow, mate. in front there. Get our dodge. Get those cultists down. Alright, casting. Get out of dodge. 
Remember casters, you can also target Skull as well once I've started pulling. Get Skull dead as soon as we can and we have a good time. You don't want to take full Shadow Bot while he's that's why we're doing it this way. Cool. This is our final group. You guys have been doing well so far. They're casting, we get our dodge. Bartek, you attacked the cultist and pulled it. While we're still fighting acolytes, that's an improved Shadow Bot volley thing on it. Alrighty, who have I assigned for Spider Wing? So we have Copeland on Cross, we have got Lightning up on Skull. Cool, let's get those marked. This one is Cross, that one is Skull. We have this one that's just going to get a star, we have this one that's going to get a circle, we have a moon, and we have a triangle. Mummy Milkies is picking up moon and triangle. We have got Mifren on the boss. Um, Funky, do you mind just picking up circle for this boss fight? Yeah, sure. Perfect. And no one is to be going near diamond at any time. Diamond is most likely going to be standing where this green mark is. Stay the fuck away from Mishtem, do not grieve him, he is our only Shadow Priest for mind controls. So just make sure you leave him room because you're going to bait Rain of Fires onto him and I'm going to shout at you. Stop and you don't want that Mishtem. Pardon? I put Soul Stone Mishtem just in case. Oh, thank you. Good idea. So is everyone happy with this? I know we're coming to the end of our consumables since I last popped mine. You should be ready. Alright, we should pull. Let's do a pull timer. Make sure we all hit a different target on pull. Daxus, can you hit triangle to make it easier for mummy? Yep. Beautiful. And everyone, make sure you hit for zero. Five, so five, five four, four, three, two, two one, and one. zero. Gull's dead. Cross to follow. Is that any beginning mind control? Ah, you could die. Oh, I got my head dumped in by Star. It's alright. Everyone be attacking Grand Widow Feralina at this point in time. Can we bring a moon and triangle all the way to circle, please? Raging 15. Can we pull circle and triangle a little bit further back towards diamond, please? You need to get triangle out of there. People are fucking cleaving it, mummy. Triangle is literally dying when we don't want it to be dying. Can you take triangle next? We need the. Pop it. Enrage. Beautiful. Just pop another one and then take what I mean. Alright, it's gonna die, so I'm just gonna pop it straight away. Yep. Master, we'll avenge you. Nice, Widow's Embrace, that's what we like to see. Very nice. Today's been a healer today. We have no SRs on it as well. I don't speak Preserving the hammer from KT. That's a pretty good stop there. So many people actually want it too, it's mental. We haven't had a massive amount of healing weapons really in this. Mm. So yeah. We're going to be precasting on Skull, we want to kill it dead. Seven second timer is going live now. Hit it for zero. Five. Tanks just four, pick up the rest of it. Three, three two, two, one, one. Zero. Kill it. Good 
job. Let's open the door. Remember, stun the ghouls at 50%. Pull everyone focus target the shade, start casting on it. We have some venom stalkers coming down, negro stalkers, whatever the fuck they are, we're gonna pull these instantly once we get them out of range. Get rid of the poisons. Big heals, big poison cleanses for yourself. Pull double gargoyles, let's just pull this pack. We will be eating after they're dead. We also have the acolytes coming. And more gargoyles. Okay, this is gonna be rough. Tanks react. We need to separate the gargoyles away from the raid because they're Thing is a range based ability, so pull the other gargoyles way the fuck away. Kill Skull before Stone Skin goes off, people. Cool. Acolytes for the fucking thing next. Pull gargoyles way away. It's a wipe. Okay. Yeah, with four <laughs> gargoyles. Now that, yeah. That's salvageable. They just weren't pulled the far enough away, but also we have the ghouls to be wary of. We, we could have got both. Well, the ideal situation for that is you get one gargoyle pack down, you deal with the acolytes while the other gargoyles are literally in Timbuk 2, and then hopefully you can then get on with the next ones, but it's a massive healing check. I'm going to run in just because I know I missed a couple of frozen rings, so I'm going to get them. Thank you, Smart. We love, but it's our Lagman's got to leave, that's okay. Did Ragnarok come back? Yes, sir. Good. Spiders? Mm -hmm. I think it's still instantly. The end of the quest line for the upper key, Kara, um, it says that there's a. Yeah, both have been pulled. Frozen runes are very nice for absorbing their fire damage. Single gargoyle. Let's kill it. Everyone focus target, big fucking damage. Go big dick.
Alright. No, no, step back. I ain't trusting you guys, we ain't skipping jack shit today. Come back here, drink your goddamn oranges, and we're gonna pull the next gargoyle pack. Go ahead, Miff, remember, we're pulling it back yeah, all the way to this lamppost near the ramp. Get back, everyone. Poison. Focus the gargoyles. Tanks pick up the spiders. Did we just pull those with iron totems? Yes. Everyone focus, man. Beware. Kill moon before stone skin goes off. Now it's time for poison cleansing and big healing across the whole raid. And people have just pretty much almost wiped again. You guys have got this, surely. Can we wake up? That's two wipes to the same fucking trash. I'm embarrassed. Somewhere I'm more blessing, whoever's been popping it with me just save the fucking dream shards until we get to south. start going up we're gonna go up the middle we aren't going up the left hand side we'll be pulling the acolytes down towards us we kill skull then we kill cross they're incoming start casting on skull Hug the wall, hug the wall as we go around. Go through the slime, jump over it or go straight through it. Hug the wall as you're going around. Once you get to the other wall and you're touching it, you're hugging that wall and you're going across the slime. Don't jump too early now, guys. You can't take a shortcut. Hug the wall around. Eat your oranges. And because this happens every week, let's get another orange pole summoned here. Alright, click the orange portal. People might need more oranges. Let's go. Beautiful. Make sure you're eating your oranges. Get to full health of mana. We're pulling the acolyte skull and cross around into the other open area. There's nothing else we can pull. Hug the wall. Touch it. Touch it all the way through. Okay, there's open space. Use it. For the next boss coming up, we do have an assigned DI before pull and a DI during the pull. For Delia, you will be DIing Meme Chan, Divine Interventioning on Meme Chan before we pull. Once we get in there, you will basically be doing it. We will then res you up and make sure you're rebuffed. During the pull, Poam, you will be DIing Divine Interventioning for Delia. That is only after the first web spray. I will call out when to do it. For the tank for this boss fight then. What have we got? We have Mithrin on the boss. We have Copeland doing the first AoE taunt 
and Gorgog doing the second AoE taunt. Everyone is here. We are missing stamina on Copeland and Daxus. We are missing spirits on group 3, a group 6, group 7. 6 and 7 matter the most. 3 has 2 casters, Thunder Fury in group 2. Daxus in group 2. Strutter in group 1. Fidelian 8. And yeah, can we uh, well bless and call the blessing uh, on Paladin or oh, on Shaman, please? And you want Shaman plus? Okay. I mean, Chang, you can always do it after. Okay, my friend, we can pull. Going. Give me a second. Don't hit early. Yeah, let him get fret. Wait for me to say do damage. Area, wait for the do damage command. Dinio, you can do damage. Make sure we have a poison dispel on Mithran. Abolish poison from Drulinka or Princess will do a treat. Save your friends. This is Svanon, Poam, Shadow Deed. They are webbed on the wall. Web spray is coming up in five seconds. We all won't be able to do anything. Make sure you reapply abolish. Break the DI. Two seconds, one second, zero seconds. Web spray over. Pump the damage. Save your friends, Fidelia, Arya, Gustadolf are on the wall. Get them down. 10 seconds till web spray. We can kill this before then. Make sure we de-eyed Fidelia, please. Beautiful timing. Fidelia, break your DI and make sure we hear the Mithra. Good job. What were we rewarded with? Shite! Eh, druid token again. That's always good. Your security measures yeah, it's not failed. a Morian rogue token. Interruption immediately. And we're going to Saf now. Pop a frost protection potion, everybody. The greater one is actually the one you should be popping. Thank you for coming, Hanny. Odds left, evens right, and I'm going to give specific assignments to the druids who are not in group 6. Group 6, we will be going with the evens on the right. This means that Shadow Deed, Kangaraxus, Princess, and Drulinka will be going on the left-hand side. Is this understood? Yes. Shadow Deed, Kangaraxus, Princess, Drulinka. And group six will be on the right because that's four and four split. This is for decursing. In phase one, you will just be all stacked together near the leg. In phase two, we spread out around the ring using the full ring. Don't go deep in the room, go around the room. Copeland. Right. You use challenging shout. I don't see how I'm sitting down eating and I didn't even push anything. Nice. Give me some bug. Came up on big wigs, that's weird. Yeah. <clears throat> I saw it, it was just as confused as you. Oh, 
also I just used it on Maxina, so how? Oh, probably a delayed out input from Big Wigs for Maxina. That makes more sense to me, because it would be on yeah. cooldown for like 10 minutes. Cool. Ready to pull? No. Iron up. Where's your potion, buddy? There we are. We're ready to pull. Remember specific sides. Odd groups are on the left, even groups on the right. And Kangaraxus, Princess, Drulinka, Shadow Deed are on the left. Make sure we decurse as priority one when that happens. Stack up next to the legs when we're attacking. Make sure you're in range to be decursed. In phase two, spread out around the room. Use the full circles that you see. Don't and let Mithrin get fret. Don't attack, don't attack, don't attack, don't attack, don't attack. Kunitada, by attacking. Attack, 5k fret. The curse priority one. Copeland, there we are. Already time for the second pot? Well, I guess it's time to pop it then, people. Spreading out around the room. I got the first ice block, so watch threat. That's right. Ice block number two's down. Ice block three is coming down now. It's on Zinio. Ice block number four. Start looking at the ice blocks. Start getting close to them. Start getting ready to get behind them. Get behind an ice block. You have three seconds. Two, zero. Congratulations, you all managed to get behind the ice block. Get back to your side. Back up on the leg again. Get ready to decurse and decurse. Decurse again. One more decurse round, let's go. He's gonna start flying into the air, get ready to start spreading out. Spread out around the room, use the full circle. Don't go deeper into the room, just spread out around the circle. Area's ice blocked. Coincidence is ice blocked. We've got a third ice block out. Fire's ice blocked. Start looking for them, start going towards them. Beware. Get behind an ice block before this shit hits the ground. Beautiful. Let Mithrim pick it up, kill him dead. Mithrim, what happened to your freight? Freight today? I don't know. Decurse. You've got a 50k advantage. Players Nice, didn't you? I think you've been talking about that for a while. Face of death as well. Our preparations continue as yeah. planned, awesome. Master. It is good that you serve me so faithfully. Soon all. At least it's not the fucking left eye of saffron for the 15th and time. In the end, you Frost shall protection be potion, people. Let's go. I'm on call down in the two minutes, so yeah. I don't I see. Will see no complications at this. Wait, what is I this? Okay, one the face the of death is so Your reserved for Copeland, but it's requested failed. for a transport by Rapture, immediately. so I'm sending it to him first. Yes, Master. Uh, Remember, Enchanter of Abyss Shoulders.
not damaging you, big roller. Are they best shoulders? Kinda of curious, Hazel. Don't want to waste an enchant now. I don't think we have a rule against it though, right? What? No. I will. I'll make sure of it. No, 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 no. I just asked if they're best shoulders you've not replied. Ah, sorry. Uh, yes, they do have best shoulders. And these are actually for my, uh, in preparation of Kara 40. Ah, cool. They can get through your next tier set. I'll keep my yes, system fit. That's cool. I already have the end shells from Soul Group as well ready, so, yeah, get ready. Alright. Whoever I'm giving these to better link me their best shoulders and I better get confirmation from someone else that it is their best shoulders. I don't need, I took these in preparation of Kara 40 for the next tier shoulders. It's turn to prepare. I mean... Rules has written, he's SR'd it, he can take it. That's how the SR system works. Yep, yeah, if that's what he values the most. Yeah. That's his choice. So, I'm getting Daxus as the highest roll here. Daxus, can you link your shoulder pads? They are Cryptalker shoulders. Anyone who knows anything about Hunters, this good? That's just tier yeah. 3. Yep. Yeah, it's good. Yeah, I'm aware it's tier 3. Okay, good, good. Cool, I'm still waiting for Frost Protection Potions. Back Cross protection potions. Cool. Yeah, I'll get to that. I was waiting for loot to be finished because sometimes it gets complicated, so I'd rather not have to stop explaining in the middle of it. Tanks, come stack with me on blue square circle. Come on blue circle tanks. We've got strutter, we've got lightning up, we've got gorgarg. Any more tanks, or is it just you three? Mummy as well. Mm -hmm. Yes. Cool. Cool. Warriors, you're stacking on the purple mark over here. Valoring, you're going to be with the Warriors. Rogues, you're coming to me with the green mark. There's only two of you. We will also be taking Lake Sharks key. Mummy Milkies over to the screen mark. Yep. We have Zinio, where's Fanon? You're on the green mark. Look at the people with you currently. Stack up as tight as you can. Every single person is there. Make sure you're literally directly on top of each other. Valorant, getting your stack. Cool. You need to be stacking this tight or better during the boss fight. You can't be fucking this up. If you get too close to Mithrin because you aren't stacking, you're going to cause the Frost Tomb to take on more people and it's going to be a massive heal check that we don't want to have to deal with. Understood? Remember these groups, this is where you're going on phase two during the fight. Cool. So, Mishtem is behind KT's throne. Coincidence is on the opposite side. We only have two shackles. We need someone to be doing kings during this boss fight, please. When the guardians are spawning at 40%, just so they can pull threat on them. I have trust in Funky or Lightning Up to be doing this. Come out of the room, please. Ragnarok. Out. Paladins, make sure you use internal on dead, make sure we're getting the skeletons down during all of the phase, all the first phase. When the um, big bullshit abominations get to the center ring, you need to stun it. 
we need to make sure we're focusing down the soul weavers. Everyone is pretty much attacking during phase one. Soldiers of the cold dark. Obey the call Is that just how it works? No intercepts on the abominations. And warriors, remember to use your kicks on the frost bolts. Mm -hmm. Yep, in KT phase 2, we need to make sure we're always interrupting the frost bolts. The only people who can chase KT when mind control happens is Zinio and um, which to Copeland. I'll give faith to Copeland to interrupt with Pummel. The frost bolts when KT's running in mind control. Yeah, no emerald buff. Get fucking used to it. Cool, what? one o'clock for the first soul weaver. Learning the clock It's at seven o'clock. Warlocks, it's worth doing the Curse of Shadows on them, just for the extra damage. Can you turn off the aspect of the pack? Oh god, you've been asking for people to sunder all raids, so I'll make sure I look into it after this raid. Whoever isn't sundering is going to have a bad time next week. It's at 6 again, by the way. Mama! <laughs> that was insane. So pretty Mercury was in the room. <laughs> oh, that's good. 11 o'clock. Well, I'm glad the music helps someone else's vibe. Yeah, the punishment, please stop. <laughs> <laughs> no more torture, please. Eleven? Um, no, sorry, nine. Uh, I'm only shot for. Lots of skeletons. Let's clean these up ASAP. Doing better. Good job. We are looking at nine o'clock. Yep, yeah, nine. My God, that's my wake-up tone on Saturdays and Sundays. What Ragnarok singing? Was that Ragnarok? Was it? Yes. Three o'clock. Oh, it'll be. Does anyone else normally sing the um, instrumental for this? Seven.
11 o'clock next. 6, right? 11 o'clock oh, next. Oh, 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 6 o'clock first, yeah. Balls. 6 o'clock, everybody. Change now. 6 o'clock. 6 o'clock. Skeletons. We pulled the 6 o'clock one. Oh, someone attacked it? Okay, back to 11 o'clock. Get these skeletons down. What the fuck was that? Weird. Yeah, we had a couple of double A bombs here as well. Get in position. Skeletons still? Get the skeletons going. Tanks pick up low on front damage for a second while Mithrin positions. Get into your groups, get into those stacks. I just had you in. Stack tight. Tight. Very, very tight. Shadow Fisher. Kick, kick. Your petty magics are no Valorant too close. For the might of the Perfect. Check your add on. You see Mithrin's name in the box? You done fucked up. The stack better and mommy totems. Hmm. Who's too close? Call them out, tell them to move. Frost protection? Nope, don't repop frost protection, sorry. Frost blast. First mind control coming up, slow damage, casters stop. Casters, stop casting. Stop your cast. Mind control has gone out. Wait for a tank to pick it up. Wait for it to get back, put back into position. We have Gorgai on threat. CC I should. CC Fanon. CC Amatha Hunter. Good job dodging. That's Fisher in the back. CC I should again. There we are. Mind control over. I have to see Gorgok's name in the box. Bloody good money. Good attempts. Mm -hmm. You're too close. Fisher. Akuno, you look a bit close, mate. I can't see anything. Are we, are we stopping? Yeah, we're going to slow damage again now. We're going to pretty much stop everything. Casters, stop, don't. Stop. stop pushing. Everyone, stop pushing. Stop, stop, stop. Escape. Press escape. Wait for mind control. Wait for it. Off tank. Start attacking Shadow it Fisher. once. Move out of Fisher. Mind control, come on. Oh, this is fun. Maybe we should have kept pushing. Shadow Fisher. Wait. Kick. Interrupt. Frost Blast. Come on, Mind Control, where are you at? <laughs> mind Control. There we are, CC Valorin, CC Shadow Deed, CC Daxus. Move out of the Fissure. Make sure we pick up, make sure we restabilize. Mithrin is the main tank. Pump your damage now, everybody. We need to make sure we're getting these Guardians dealt with. CC Valorin again. That's good. Pump damage, use your cooldowns, use everything on KT. We need to push it dead in the next 40 seconds. We have Guardian on the left side, we need it to be kited, we need a tank on it ideally. King spam also. Yep. Turn undead these guardians, do whatever we need to to deal with them properly. Pump damage guys, and we will have this dead. Yep. Use everything you've got, guys. Guardian running most currently. Move out of that. Good job, I won't. Just keep blasting. Lip and blast. Just run in now. Spam your abilities on him. Your instant cast abilities, like Moon Fire, for example. Just getting dead. Good job, people. That's a dead KT. That was a one, one try. That's what we like to see. Nice Drip Neck. Nice Wand. Let's write this. Two Rings of Faith and Flaterally. Coin, did you want a second ring? Not even yeah, for turns with patches? <laughs> I Only him the one actions. if he enchants his weapon. I think so too. I think we need a commitment <laughs> on the third spell power enchant before the, <laughs> this goes down. No, no. I am very happy with his enchant. In fact, I have the same one. Yeah, two X-Gravers. 
Two griefers. It's spreading, guys. It's spreading. Fucking dizzy. Guys, this was a sub three hour raid, so it's a good job. But you all need to wake up in the future and just play a little bit more reactive and play a little bit more better. Because this raid could have been a lot faster overall. Instead of coming up to 2 hours and 53 minutes, we could have easily been done with this in around 2 hours and 15.